first one was $31 on Amazon, so it's about the same price as the other one. So a similar box to the other one as well. You can tell it's already going to be a lot shorter, which is good. And here it is. A lot shorter. It's I don't know how to explain it, but it is really extremely heavy compared to the other one. I guess they don't really add any instructions to how much weight it was. I think it almost is a pound, if not, though. Um, I asked them if it came with threads. They said no, it should be an exact fit. So that's a second company. So I guess really finding a perfect fit, the um, the, the 10 by 1.25, I guess that really is difficult to make on its own. So they do just make adapters. But honestly, I think I'm gonna find this one way better already because it's just gonna be a lot shorter. So it will sit all the way down inside the knob. So I really shouldn't have any issues. And, Honestly, guys, I wish I could explain. This is really, really heavy compared to the other one I had, let alone any other shifter. Um, I'm pretty sure it is a pound. You can see it on the link in the description below that um, will tell you how much it does weigh. So it does come with four little adapters here. Um, I'm not sure if they're all the I mean, I'm assuming they're not the same size. No, definitely not. So I'll have to find which one is the right size for my car. And I'm going to get this one hooked up for you guys and show you how it looks installed. See you in the next video. Alright guys, here we are. We're here to install the Neochrome shift knob that I bought. First step is to take off your stock one. Or for me, it's this aftermarket carbon fiber one that I bought. Um, it was from my old car. I just threw it on for the time. So first is to take that off. Um, like I said, they give you the four different threads to choose from. Find the one. Hopefully that fits. There we go. Or not. Alright. So we're going to screw that all the way on. And you can see also, by the way, this piece is the is a fake 5D carbon fiber wrap. Um, really cheap for big rolls. I'll admit to review on that in a different video. But I did use that all throughout my car. Wrapped all this stuff myself and it did turn out really nice. Anyways, so like I said, I'll do that in another video. And then the next step... Is just thread it right on there. But that's how it's going to sit. I like it way better. Um, if you've never used a weighted shift knob, I can tell you right now, it's a big difference when you're shifting. You never will miss gears or anything like that. And um, it just feels way nicer when driving. But this is going to be what it looks like. And, but other than that, it's really nice. And it definitely reviews one better than the last one. Um, the other one was just lighter, way bigger. Way too tall for my likings. I thought it was going to be okay, but personally, it just was way too much. So I'm going to keep this.